One of the hardest objections to overcome in the annuity or slash insurance world is overcoming that relationship that the client or prospect already had. Stay with me because I'm going to show you a great way to get around that objection. Hi, my name is Jeremy Smith and over the better part of the last 15 years I've been an agent, a manager, an owner operator of an insurance brokerage and over the last five or six years I've been a business coach traveling the country to help agents and agencies grow their practice. Stay with me because I'm going to help you grow yours. If you've been on YouTube before then you know the game. Please like and comment and don't forget to ring the bell. Step one of my annuity uh, presentation is a step that actually starts at the very end of my fact finder, okay? I literally probably still have the fact finder turned over with notes about what they've just told me, okay? There's about four key points I want the inside of step one of the, what I call the money talk, okay? First thing is I want you to understand that this is an open forum conversation, okay? I want them to talk. I got things that I want to say, but I want them to talk. I want to hear what their education is and what their knowledge is of the economy and the stock market and finances. I want to hear them talk about what concerns they have. Um, I also, in that same motion, this is... This is a great opportunity for me to show my education and my expertise, okay? I want to be able to show them, I want to show them that I've been there before and, and, and I know as much as anybody you're going to get in front of about the options that are out there for your retirement money, especially the safe options that are out there. Now, obviously, one of the big things I want to hear from them is I'm, as I'm hoping to hear from them concerns about the casino stock market, Okay. I want, I want to get it out of their mouth and hopefully the other spouse, if there's somebody else there, to hear it and maybe even confirm it, that they're scared that the fact that they've got 85% of their money in an IRA or a 401k or something tied to the stock market, okay? I want to hear that come out of their mouths because if I hear that come out of their mouths, I know I'm halfway home already on making a, an annuity presentation slash sale, okay? But the other thing out of my own voice that I want them to hear is I want them, again, to hear my expertise, but I'm going to start making my presentation on why I don't think that where their money is at now aligns with the goals and philosophies they told me back in the fact finder. For example, uh, let's uh, take for an example the role play we did uh, a couple of videos ago where uh, the guy told me that he doesn't consider himself a risk taker, yet Literally 90% of his money was in an IRA, okay? I normally will go through and explain to them, listen, we've been on a ride right now where the stock market has been up for well over a decade now, straight up. We're in a time right now, I mean, gosh, I didn't even have to tell you about this, where the world's crazy, okay? There's all kinds of things going on right now. Bad indicators. You can turn on any uh, channel you want, you'll be hard pressed to find any financial analyst that says the stock market's just gonna keep going like this forever. You'll find some that thinks it's gonna bounce around, some that thinks it's gonna get stagnant, some may think we're gonna have superinflation. You'll find a good percentage of people that think there's a crash or at least a correction coming in the near future. But there's nobody saying, hold on to your hat, the stock market's gonna just keep going up, okay? Well, because of that, uh, and I assume you share in those same beliefs and, and philosophies. Because of that, what I'd like to do is I'd like to talk with you about what I think one of the best safe money options in the country is. Okay, I want to talk to you about a product where you can get stock market type returns without taking the gambles. You want to hear that? So again, I've got permission to go on. But I've already, in that step, I have initiated so many things that we're going to talk about in steps two, three, four, five, six, and seven, and eight of the annuity presentation. And again, we're going to be overcoming objections right and left. With that conversation, we just overcame one big, big one, and that was by getting their buy-in, whether verbal or or just uh, their body, or both. They've already bought into the fact that their risk tolerance and what they feel comfortable with does not align with where their money is at right now. Man, that is, you're a long ways down the road with just that right there.
I want to remind you to please hit subscribe and ring the bell, and we'll look forward to seeing you on our next video. Thank you.